Let's update to 1.19.1. All right, we found ourselves back in Telltale once more. And in this tutorial, we're going to be updating to 1.19.1, of course, as, well, the new version has come out and, well, we want to be up to date. So for this, of course, what you can do is you can just go to the 1.19.1 page here for Ford and we can see the newest version is 42.0.1. So that's going to be exactly what we update to. So in our build.gradle file, what we're going to do first of all is we're going to use the official mappings for 1.19.1 and then we're also going to go down all the way here to 42.0.1. And then of course, this is 1.19.1. So this should be the string. Of course, when you're watching this in the future, this will hopefully be a little bit of a higher number at that point. And hopefully as well, all of the subsequent 119 versions are going to be roughly compatible with everything that we're going to do after this. And well, let's just reload this, right? Hit the little elephant at the top right corner and let this build. Once again, can take anywhere from a few seconds all the way to a minute, two minutes and a little bit above that. And then we'll see. Best case scenario, we actually don't have to change anything. I believe that everything should work. Although one tiny change we will make just because that is a fix from a previous tutorial. But let's just let this run through and hopefully we'll get a build successful here at the end. And there we go. Build successful in one minute, 53 seconds. Perfect. And in theory, if we go back here, we should have no errors. Now there's one tiny fix that we want to do that is from the mod messages. I've already put this in a pinned comment on the networking tutorial. However, we actually want to call mod messages register here at the top of the NQ work runnable and everything should still work totally fine. So keep that in mind as well. That is one fix that we should do if you've been following through the networking tutorial. Regardless of that, Everything else should, in theory, work. So we should just be able to run the client and no errors should be present, hopefully, and the game should just start. So let's see if that actually is the case. Right in here we are, 119.1, perfectly loaded and everything still working. So that is actually a very good sign. So going forward, of course, we're going to be using 119.1 at this point. 4101 over here as the version. So it could be possible that some things going forward might be incompatible with 119. So I do suggest updating, although usually the differences shouldn't be that crazy overall. Whatever the case may be, that's going to be it for this tutorial right here. I hope you found this useful and I'll see you all in the next tutorial. Oh yeah.